Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. I know I haven't created a video in a quite a while, but that has been because I've been pretty busy. I've created a game with one of my friends, and I recently started school, so I've had a lot to do. But in this video, I'm going to show you how to get the mink race and how to use the mink orb inside of row fruits. Now, if you're watching this video, you probably already got the mink orb and you're just extremely confused, because that's actually why I'm making this video. I found this game, I got the mink orb, and I'm like, what? How do I use it? So I'm gonna tell you that. And if you did not get the mink orb, I'm gonna tell you how to get that as well. First, let's say you're at the starter island. All right, so if you're inside of spawn island, to get the mink orb, you wanna go to that island right over there, which is called monkey island. If you cannot see that because your graphics are too low, you can look in your map here, and you, as you can see right out there, you just want to kind of go left and you should be able to find it. You can just look at the direction I'm going and go in the same direction. If you already have the fruit, make sure not to touch the water because that will kill you. Boom. When you were on Monkey Island, I think there might be two ways to actually get it, but I'm not sure. I saw a video like a really long time ago because I was looking of ways to do it myself, but it was like in Spanish and it was like really old and stuff where they got it from a different boss, but I don't think it's like that because the map has changed. But pretty much to get the mink orb, you can get it from this guy over here. You can't really see him, uh, but boom, his name is question mark, question mark, question mark. He also gives you like a ton of levels. Um, I don't, I can't really kill him by myself. So what I do is I just hit him once and then this guy just kills him because these guys are just like farming him. And okay, I'm scared now because I'm going to die. But if you kill him enough times, I think it is pretty rare. Oh, okay. I'm literally going to die because this guy's scary, but you should be able to get it. You might have to be here for a little while. I don't know. I killed him like three times, maybe five times before I got it. So it wasn't that hard for me, but I don't think anyone else in the server actually got it. Oh, okay, this guy's gesturing for me to hit him, so I'm gonna do that. And yeah, I just realized, yeah, this guy has to be the only one here because he's level 250. When you go here, you might wanna go up here. You might be thinking, like, you might be looking around and stuff, and you might see this blue guy that is literally called a mink, and you're like, oh, I have the mink orb. I should be able to use it. No, this guy does nothing. Don't talk to him. It's a waste of time. What you really wanna do is go back to your map, look at where the desert is which should be just like totally that direction towards the starter island just go like way more left so like this way it is pretty far so it's kind of scary if you're going there because like oh i'm probably gonna die in the water but you're not because even if you do have a fruit you can last in the water for a while and it does actually restart all of your jumping stuff so you can just keep going infinitely 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 and you're gonna heal When you start getting closer, you can kind of see this weird thing, like the sky kind of changes and it turns into weird shapes. This is just because like the lighting that they make it and they make it so it's like invisible if you're too far away. So you can just see the entire map. You might not be able to see that if your graphics are too low, but I'm pretty much here. This is actually the sand island. It doesn't look so much sand and I was kind of confused the first time I went here. I'm like, oh, is this the right place? But if you go here, boom and you just spam jump you should be able to go up one way i went up here oh yeah yeah okay it's pretty easy you go here there's a whole lot of buildings in this big arena thing you want to ignore all of this and all these guys out here i actually haven't looked at them i'm gonna check them out real quick yeah level 100 uh wait hold on oh no 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 they're way too strong i don't, I don't want to die and lose my mink fruit this bunny soul thing that's like kind of a mink fruit i'll show you um you get it after you get the mink fruit so you get the mink fruit, you go here, go all the way around, all the way around. This is like really long thing. I don't know why they made it like this and there's like no way to actually know, but you go all the way to this building to the very end and you turn left and there is this blue dummy. He might be different. He might be NPC in the future, but you want to talk to this guy while holding it and he'll give you a bunny soul, which I'm holding right now. As you can see, bunny soul, kind of transparent little bunny. And now this, you want to bring to that one mink guy that you saw before in the monkey island. I'm not sure if you can reset. I'm kind of too scared to do it. I don't really want to try it because I don't want to grind to actually get the mink fruit again. So I'm not going to do that. And I'm just going to do a low time lapse just so you know which way you need to go to get back.
All right, so if you go all the way here, you might have forgotten, but it is up there, the highest point in all of Monkey Island. I actually have no idea what Mick does or where it brings you or anything like that, because I haven't actually got it. Uh, I just got the bunny solo, I'm like, oh, I gotta make a video. This is a good thing to make a video about. I might as well help others if I'm doing it. And you go to Mink, I think you gotta hold it, press E, or just click, and boom. Okay, um, where am I? Okay, I'm just on this place right here, and I have ears. I think that's just what Mink is. I don't know if this actually does anything. I might actually join the Discord. I think I'm gonna join the Discord real quick and see what it does. Alright, so, um, I just joined back, and there are a ton of fruits here. This has nothing to do with it. What is this? I don't know. What are any of these? I have bomb. I bet this one is better though. I'm gonna eat it. Wanna eat fruit? Yes. Okay, what do I have? Wait, do I have like gum gum now? No way. Wait, isn't this like, I think this is actually kind of rare. Okay, that's lucky, I guess. Uh, I just found out nowhere. And also like two best guys in the server send me a friend request for no reason. Maybe they know my YouTube channel or something. But I figured out what Mink does. Shout out to Grim inside of the Discord server. I'm probably going to link their Discord server in the description. Also, that reminds me, I'm going to link my Discord server in the description. So join that one as well. But this guy tells you, if you get Mink, you can activate Awakening. And you can dash longer. And you won't have dash cooldown for a short amount of time. I have like no idea what he means by activate Awakening. Since I don't have an Awakening, nothing to activate. I don't know. Um... Oh, okay, I, I can drop these easy. I'm gonna get rid of those because those are kind of annoying. This fruit is pretty good though. Uh, Mink is cool. I'm gonna go see. Okay, so dash cooldown like for a little bit. Okay, let's see. Let's see how many times I can dash. I don't know the normal amount, but if I keep dashing over and over and over and over and over and over again. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. That was really cool. Whatever I just saw is really cool. And it actually does look like I'm dashing way more. Um, yeah, but also there's like a ton of new, uh, a ton of other races. He said there's like a sky one that's better. I'm probably going to make a video about that one also. Um, but I just want to show this one because this one I was actually like really curious about. And I had no idea what it did. So yeah, it does look like I am actually dashing a lot more. I dash all the way there and I'm going to dash back. The only problem is that I keep going down so I can't really see. But there, yeah, there, there looks like there's like no dash. And I can see I also do dash longer. Way longer. And uh, jumping, I think that's the same. Because I think I can, yeah, okay. If I spam jump. Oh, wait. No, yeah, yeah, it's the exact same. I actually wonder, if you spam jump and if you press Q afterwards, what happens? Oh, nothing. Okay. Yeah, I think that's going to be the end of the video. And I'm probably going to make more about this game. Comment down below if there's any other games. Sorry I haven't made any videos about... Shadow Vest, I don't know, I just haven't really been in the mood and don't really feel like Shadow Vest is something to make, I want to make videos about right now. Comment down below if you want to see more videos about this game and just like gameplay and stuff and what you want.